Hey, my name is Mike, and in this video, I'll be showing you how to set up and how to use Google Workspace, which could very well be one of the most powerful tools you can have for your business. I've been using it to manage my businesses for about six years now, and I couldn't imagine running a business without it. So now the next thing I highly recommend doing is setting up what's called two-factor authentication. This allows you to have an extra layer of security when you're signing into your account. So in order to do this, you can click on your account on the top right, go to manage your Google account, and then click on security on the left side. By the way, you can actually do this with all of your Gmail accounts as well, but I think for businesses, it's especially important because you just have much more exposure than most individuals. If we scroll down, two-step two authentication or two-step verification is off, we can turn it on. So we can do this either by uh, you know, receiving text messages, I'm gonna do that right now, then type in your phone number. That's gonna be one way, it's gonna be text messages, but you could also set this up with Google prompts. So if you have an Android phone, that works. Authenticators, you can get like the Microsoft Authenticator app, the Google Authenticator app. There's a lot of Authenticator apps out there. You could use your phone number for texting or it could call you to give you a code. Backup codes are something you print and download and save in like a, a safe somewhere uh, just in case you ever need those codes. And of course, pass keys and security keys. If you have like a Yubico key, you can plug that in and, uh, you know, just a little, uh, you tap the top and that's how you can actually, you know, do your two factor for that. So I highly recommend that if you have that set up and let's go back to admin, admin.google.com. And from here, what I recommend doing is going down to users. So go to directory, go to users. And then if we just click on any user, it doesn't matter. Let's click on our user right here. We can go to the security tab on the top once it's loads, so security right there. And then you can see two-step two authentication is on. But if I click change security settings right here, it'll bring me over to this. And here we can say, one, do you want to allow other employees to have two-factor authentication? I usually recommend yes. Do you want to enforce it? Like, do they have to have this? So I usually would say yes. I think that's important for a business. And you can change some settings about how frequently do they have to sign back in? Are they allowed to trust their device and not need two-factor every time they sign in? And different things like that.